Hello and welcome to another one of my videos and in today's video I am going to be talking about a recent purchase I bought from CPM CPM coins so these are some one gram ingots before I get into it I just want to put out a quick thank you to the people who actually subbed to my channel yesterday so there was 22 of you which was really overwhelming um, I really do appreciate it so for those of you who don't know what I talk about, I, I'm a gold and silver coin dealer. I also deal in stamps. You know, my, my channel talks about gold and silver and coins, like the, the struggles I go through as a dealer, the good times, the bad times. You know, I don't really gloss it over. I also talk about uh, economics and other things that relate to gold and silver. So yeah, got that one out of the way. It's only been, gonna be a quick one today. It won't be about the Zimbabwean notes. Long story short, is I've got another microphone on order and I want the the sound to be better when I put that one out because I know a lot of people have been asking me for it. So let's get into it. What do I have? So this come out about from an offer that was that I was tagged in by one of the people on well on the, the back the metal group. And I missed the first one. I think this is the second in series. The first one was the Brexit ingot, and it came in one gram and five gram. This one is the Battle of Britain 80 year ingot, and it comes, I don't think they've got a five gram version of this. Oh, it isn't out yet. So a limited edition of just under 20,000. I don't know why they're five short of 20,000. I don't even think it will get to this. Uh, these are probably mint to order. I don't believe they've got 20,000 of these made on the basis that it's a lot of money to put into stock especially at the the markup they are making like these were 49 pounds each let's turn it over let's see if we can get a an in-depth view it wouldn't go in yesterday or earlier i only got these in today sorry that's okay it's not the best but you can see the unicorn on the line. It's really quite nice. It's a nice design. As for the company, they do throw out offers. They they will phone you, they will spam you, but this is certainly worth the £49 I spent. So I'm not sure what I'm going to do with these. Most likely I'm going to flip them. They're probably worth about £60 a pop. I'd say 55 on on the low the low end and i'll probably add postage on top although i i was thinking about it and i might i'm i'm going to be doing a giveaway at 750 subs uh just to show my appreciation i might stick one of these in it you know i think that'd be quite nice so there will be a little game with the giveaway i always try and do something that's a bit quirky something that's a bit different something that people will enjoy that gets people involved so but yeah, I, I think one of these will probably be in that giveaway. I don't know why it's 80 years of the Battle of Britain. I think they're scraping the barrel with that one. It it seems like an odd thing to celebrate in terms of an anniversary. You'd probably celebrate 75 years or 90 years. 80 years is just a bit weird in my mind. But I do like the design. I do think that's quite nice. So yes, anyone who wants to order these, you can find them at cpmcoins.com. This isn't a paid advertisement. I just think it's a really good deal on these. They probably will spam you to death. If they phone you, just say, just politely say, I'm sorry, I'm not interested. Um, can you take me off your phoning list? And then that way you won't get suckered into buying their more premium items that are probably overcharged in my opinion. But yeah, it's not it's not a paid advertisement. I just think it's a good deal, and I think it's it's quite a nice one gram ingot. So I thought I'd share it with the channel. So yeah, I hope you've enjoyed it. If you did, then please like, comment, and subscribe. And I hope you have a really nice day. Bye.